officially entered the month of March. That means state basketball and the Big Sky women's and men's basketball tournaments, possibly followed by the NCAA tournament. But that also means Grizz football got going with their spring ball this week. Here's more from Washington Grizzly Stadium. On Monday afternoon, the Montana Grizzly football team took Washington Grizzly Stadium for the first of their 15 spring practices, culminating with the spring game at Hamilton High School on April 10th. Coming into the 2020 season, the biggest storyline is who will be the quarterback and fill in the void left after Dalton Sneed graduated. Senior Cam Humphrey, sophomore transfer Robbie Patterson, and sophomore Chris Brown have all taken reps on the first two days of spring ball, but who will be protecting them this year on the O-line is still up in the air. Certainly we'll have great competition on the O-line this spring and we're hoping different guys can learn different positions so we can roll people in and based on our health or, or performance in the season, roll guys in and get our best five out there any, any given week. One position group that is nearly already solidified is the wide receiving core that returns all conference performers like Samuel Akem and Samari Toure. We've had got two guys that are returners that have made All-America teams, so that's a good place to start. I think the, the other guys in the depth have playmaking ability, so you know I think that has a chance to be a strength of the team and, and they'll be from A to Z will be a complete group. Regardless of how the individual position battles play out in spring, Hauk is looking for one thing and one thing only in spring ball, improvement. You know, we need to get better technically and then we need to, you know, fundamentally, essentially, and then we need to get better in terms of knowledge of the game. And um, as I say often and has been told to me many times, the only way to get better at football is to play it, so we need to get out and play.